flashy stuff. I don't want any crystal or anything like that. The well, pleasure chest takes care of that with the Hitachi magic wand. <laughs> it's a two-speed massager from 1981. Soft, flexible head, relaxes sore muscles, deep, soothing vibrations, helps relieve tension, dual speed control, and good for fucking yourself. <laughs> Andrew Overdahl and I were uh, we were looking through the big book of dicks over there. I was taking a look seeing that. We got some huge dicks in there. There was a guy, he was in a, a truck, and his dick was in you know in, well in, intertwined with the steering wheel. <laughs> and Andrew goes, What would you ever go sit in an abandoned truck <laughs> to get a picture of your giant dick in that steering wheel? <laughs> Yeah, for 150 bucks. <laughs> Could the greeting cards be any closer together? I'm trying to look at one, somebody else is gonna grab them, we're gonna touch hands, and I'm doing poppers in the alley. <laughs> I didn't know what poppers were, this is true. I went to a gay bathhouse in search of nitrous when I was living in Chicago. <laughs> and I'm fine with every part of that sentence. <laughs> I remember that. <laughs> I went in and I was like, do you guys have any nitrous? And the guy was like, um, I don't think so. We have vending machines with stuff in there. And I was like, well, is there nitrous in them? And he goes, I don't know, you can go check. Um, you do know what this is, right? And I went, yeah, yeah. I'm just looking for nitrous. <laughs> Which sounded like the weirdest excuse, like trying to pretend like I was straight at a gay bathhouse. <laughs> yeah, oh, I'm not here for the dick, okay? <laughs> I'm here for a carny truck, all right? <laughs>